Following the slowdown of the COVID-19 pandemic, Taiwan's Taoyuan Airport has seen passenger volume rebound to over 90 percent of its 2019 peak, with 45 million travelers expected in 2024. This surge has exceeded the combined capacity of Terminals 1 and 2, driving the urgent push to complete Terminal 3. Recent reports show that Terminal 3's construction is 67 percent complete, with the main terminal at 43 percent. The departure hall is on the third floor, with high ceilings, tall columns, and the roof already under construction. Terminal 3's construction involves more than just the terminal building. It also includes the apron, runway sections, and boarding gates. Building on top of the Taoyuan Airport MRT line has made the process challenging, requiring 24-hour monitoring during excavation and backfilling. The total cost of Terminal 3 has reached nearly 130 billion NT dollars, making it Taiwan's largest single investment since the 10 major construction projects. Not after Terminal 3 is completed, the main terminal, along with the north and south concourses, will be able to handle 20 million passengers. The first phase will be completed in mid-2025, with the north concourse finished first. Once this part is done, we will be able to handle about 5.8 million passengers. Before the pandemic, passenger volume in 2019 was around 48.68 million. According to the latest figures, Terminals 1 and 2 likely handled 30 million passengers by the end of August. When Terminal 3 becomes fully operational, the combined capacity of all three terminals will reach 82 million passengers. Despite being 1% behind schedule, the North Concourse of Terminal 3 is still expected to be completed by mid-2025, providing much-needed relief for Terminals 1 and 2. 谢丹慈、徐昆山、北边小 TVBS World Taiwan。